He's coached some teams with some really cool names like the Chill, the Speed, the Killer Bees, and of course the Mallards. But he also played for some teams with some very familiar names like the Blackhawks, the Kings, the Penguins, and the North Stars. Now this game is played on ice, but it remains very fresh to Mallards head coach Terry Ruskowski. There's always new things that I like to uh, try, and the systems have changed. Uh, it's got to be speed and good passing now. That's where it's at. And uh, the other thing, especially in training camp, and you spend all summer recruiting. You want to see what you got. Yeah. You know, it's just like uh, you did all this work. Now let's see what actually what do I have. And that's the exciting part. Sometimes there, there's, you know, boy, I didn't know if I should have got that guy. And they go, whoa, boy, am I glad I got this guy. Was this part of the game plan when you were playing? You know, that I'd be coaching this long. I guess. Did you foresee no. that? No, I, I didn't foresee that. It just. Somebody said, when are you going to retire from coaching? I said, when winning and losing doesn't mean much to me, then I'll step away and I'll say, okay, I've done it, I've had it, and uh, I walk away. But the you know, losing part still is with me hard, and I don't like it. The winning part I love, and I told the guys, I'm a great winner, but I'm a horrible loser, so keep me happy. Ruskowski will be making plenty of chess moves once the schedule begins, but maybe this time of the year, tryouts and training camp could be the most challenging because there are so many unknowns. Right now, we don't have the, our main squad here. We still have guys in the American League camp, and we want to teach these guys, but we also know that when the guys are coming back, we've got to reteach them. So not too much now because when the guys get back, that's when we really want to emphasize our systems and, and put them into place and practice. And I think repetition, again, is a big factor. Once they do it often enough, that it, they don't have to think about it. It just comes second nature to them, and they just go ahead and do what they have to do to be successful. If it's forechecking, backchecking, if it's power play, penalty killing, they know exactly what to do, when to do it. And once we get that down, it's going to be a lot better for the players and for me to coach and to make sure that we're doing the things right. The Mallards begin the 2016-17 season right here at the I Wireless Center on October 14th. Hey, if you're looking for more information on Fellowship of Christian Athletes, be sure to check out our website at IllawaFCA.org. With this FCA Story of the Week, I'm Dan Pearson.